Hello everybody, Brad Curry here and I want to go over the Google training site looking at level 1 and level 2 modules as you look to become a Google educator. So what you'll do is you go to the Chrome browser on your device and you will Google Google Training Center. That will bring you to the first link here, Google for Education Training. Click on it, and you'll see a website here aimed at helping educators with learning about Google Apps for Education. And the main part you want to focus on is the training. So if you drag your mouse over to that part, and you look here at the different options, you'll want to go to the educator training. Click on educator training. A new tab will pop up. With a plethora of resources. Okay. And for this brief 10 minute webinar, we want to look at the certification process. So I'm going to click on certification and it gives you different options. You want to be an educator level one, educator level two, Google certified, on down to trainer and innovator. But we're going to focus on level one and level two. You have the option of picking either one. I would recommend that you start with level one and work your way to level two. But whatever it is you want to do, that's fine. So you click on learn more and the learn more tab brings you to this page here where it goes through fundamentals training, sample exam questions, exam details. Alright, so if we click on the fundamentals training, it'll ask you for a resource or an email address, I'm sorry. So you click on your email address, you sign in, and this way it's going to track your training, which is why they have you sign in. And then what you'll do is you'll look through the different trainings for for Google Certified Educator Level 1. Okay, this is Fundamentals Training Educator Level 1. And there's all different courses that you can take um, that are ranged from anywhere from a half hour to an hour long. Alright, and you work your way through these. As you work your way through them, it'll track your progress. Now, you may figure that, hey, you know what? I already know what there is to need to know about the paperless classroom, so I don't need to go through that. That's fine. But if you click on any one of these, you'll see here, as it opens up, Unit 2, Expand Your Access to Help and Learning, gives you an introduction, what you'll learn, and um, you can skip right to the unit review instead of going through the tutorials. Um, so it's whatever you want to do, all right? and you can do a unit review. So these sorts of uh, assessments will prepare you for the actual exam, all right? And in this particular um, unit, you're going to look at Google+, Google Groups, and Google Search. And it goes through different skills and all. I mean, it's very um, in-depth and will really help you out in becoming either level one or level two certified. And, and, that's, and that's the process, basically, okay? So then once you um, go through that, okay, you can go back and you can take another course. Uh, it's all up to you. You don't have to take every single course, but to be fully prepared for your level one training, uh, I, would, I would look into that, all right? Um, I would disregard these other two right now, figure on the, just the fundamentals training, focus on that, and you should be good to go. And then down at the bottom here, it says, do you want to become a Google certified educator level one? Let's learn more, okay? And it brings you back to that page where we started uh, a few minutes ago, and it takes you through the process. It gives you sample exam questions, all right? So once you get through the fundamental training, click on this, and it gives you some questions to go through, all right? That'll help you out. And then to get certified, it'll give you some information here on the exam details. And the reason why it does not let you in right away is because you have to um, sign up for a web assessor um, 
uh, account. And so what you need to do is you need to register for the level one exam. Again, it's $10, 180 minutes, all right, uh, and it gives you that information there. So when you're ready to register, um, you can click this button here, register for the level one exam. But before you register, maybe you want to learn some more information about the actual level one exam. So you click on see the certification fact page. And you go through the different questions. Some questions you may uh, have uh, that, you need to, that you need to ask. And so I found this uh, fact page um, very helpful. Um, and just go through it and, you know, like, for example, for how long are the certifications valid? Both certifications for Google Certified and Level 1 and Level 2 are valid for 24 months from the date of issue. So it goes through that for you. And basically, you know, once you're, all your questions are answered and you're, you think you're ready to roll, you've gone through the fundamentals training, the sample exam questions, you click to register. And when you register, then you click your email. Once you click your email, it'll ask you to go through the process. Uh, I'm not going to go through this because I already have signed up for an account. Um, but then it'll take you to the test, ask for payment, and that sort of thing. Um, so we're going to hit that, hit, go ahead and hit allow. And like I said, it's going to ask you for all this information. You're going to go ahead and fill it out uh, to create your test taker account. And then it'll bring you to the test. Everything is saved online. Once you take the tests, um, it'll, it'll push out a certificate to you. Um, and if you need to retake it, you retake it within a given time frame. You can learn more about that on the fact page that we showed you before. And uh, you'll be good to go. So let's go back to level one here. So that's level one. And then you go to level two. All right, same thing. You want to, again, get the training. Click on advanced training. Okay. And then it gets into more in-depth lessons. You pick what you want to pick. It'll keep track of it for you. So if you want to, you know, to sign out, sign out. It's all linked to your email account. All right. And once you've gone through all the different tutorials or the ones you think you need the most help with, then you go to learn more, how do I become certified level two. Um, and then again, there's exam, sample exam questions. This is a $25 exam, all right? So in total, $10 for level one, 25 for level two, all right? Then you're gonna register the same way, again, with your email account, and you'll be good to go. And again, there's a certification fact page, all right? Everything's linked to your account and will be kept online for you, all right? And, um, you know, down the road, if you want to become a trainer or an innovator, you can uh, obviously check those out on your own. Uh, but for this webinar, brief tutorial, we focus on level one and level two. If you have any further questions, you know, please reach out to me um, via email. Thank you and have a great day.